What's up guys, welcome back to Sonato Games. Today we're actually playing a new game and I'm very excited for this. It's called CrossCode. I heard good things about this online. This is kind of a, uh, I think this game either came out last year or actually, no, I take that back. I think it came out a few years ago, now that I think of it. Um, but I, I saw a video recently by Rasputin and he was going through like indie games that nobody talks about. So games under, uh, other than like Undertale and Cuphead and whatnot. And this was one of his, uh, requested games. And in the comment section, loads of people just saying, play CrossCode. This game is amazing. It's so good. I looked up stuff and this game looks incredible. So I want to try it out for myself. I was going to take you guys along with me. So let's go and hop in. About, okay. About difficulty in Sysmo, CrossCode is designed with challenge in mind for both combat and puzzles, and we encourage every player to try the game with its intended difficulty. However, those challenges end up making the game less enjoyable or even inaccessible for you. We pr uh, provide options to tweak the difficulty through the Assist tab and, uh, and the Options menu. I love games that do that. It's really nice. Not everybody can... Not everybody wants to be completely challenged. They they just want to enjoy the game for the game. Because I heard this game actually has an incredible story too. Next. Oh. I looks like Samus. I think what I remember hearing about this game, I think this game's supposed to be like an Isekai. So that that's actually a VR thing that just happened to me. I know you can hear me. Where is he? Shizuka, I have to ask you to leave. So, you're keeping him here. What do you think you're doing? Time is running short. We don't have a choice. So you abduct a dying person and let him work until his last breath? Is that it? I am going to talk some sense into him. Don't get in my way. I like this person. So move around. I'm actually going with the keyboard instead of a controller this time, so... I think this game is, like, meant to be played with keyboard and mouse anyway. I'm not a voice actor, so, uh, don't, uh, don't get offended if I don't give these characters justice. I'm sorry, but I can't let you go any further. Nani? <laughs> oh, shit. Dodge? Attack? Ooh. Ooh. Oh, that's so cool. Okay, that's actually really fun. You have to do better than that. I like that. She's running like a ninja too. I love that. <laughs> oh, this is cool. I'm actually really liking this so far. You know, the, you know this is what he wants as well. Sure, you'd like to think that. You won't listen. I don't need to listen. I'm gonna kick your ass. Cold, <laughs> based, very based. How very creative. Ooh, I got fire. It's simplistic, but it's fun. Weak to heat. I feel like this is like a... This is going to be one of those games where if you interrupt him, all of this hard work will be lost. Don't do it. So, it never should have happened in the first place. I wonder what happened. Okay, this is it. Psst, bring it the fuck on, bro. You don't know when to stop, do you? Just watch. Ooh. <laughs> Dude! <laughs> That's incredible. You can throw as many enemies at me as you like. The level threshold doesn't exactly work in your favor. Oh my god. I'm a, I'm a fan of Sword Art Online. Yeah, make fun of me if you want, but... So, I'm kind of curious about how well this... How much better this is than that. <laughs> I think this is going to be one of the first puzzles. This looks very puzzular. <laughs> Never mind. <laughs> <clears throat> He looks at Satoshi! Sister. What do you think you're doing here? <clears throat> wish I, I wish I had like a female voice actress with me right now. You're in no condition to do this kind of work. All you should do is rest. 
Why should I rest when I am beyond recovering? I need th this dude is super edgy. I need to finish this work. It's my final task. She looks so depressed. <laughs> I told you about the agreement. I finish this, and it will let you go. No, I don't want this. Silence. Satoshi. Stop it. It is done. <laughs> what the fuck? <laughs> no! Shizuka. I'm sorry. I like his shades. I'm so sorry I got you involved in this. Just promise me. That you will get away. <sighs> Please. <coughs> this game is gorgeous. I know it's like a 16-bit style game, but it's still pretty. Cross code. I dig it. I'm in. I'm, I love it so far. It's actually really cool. Excuse me. Initializing avatar. Yeah. Okay, this is a character that looked familiar. Because the other one had like different color hair and stuff. There you are. Initializing. Uh, initialization successful. Nani? Oh, is the speech synchronization malfunctioning? Which is good, since the main character- I heard that the main character actually doesn't speak, but people said that they somehow are still written well, which is very hard to do for a character who is mute. Um... But that works in my favor, because I can't do a female voice. <clears throat> Especially now, my voice is starting to give out. Apparently... Uh, apparently. Well, something just had to go wrong. But you understand me, correct? <laughs> She's adorable. I love her already. Okay, we will make it work somehow. You are probably confused about the situation, correct? Eh. <laughs> Alright, let us take small steps. Do you remember VRPS? Uh, VRPs? Virtual uh, Ricochet Projectiles. Odd thing to ask somebody who just woke up. <clears throat> no, I have no idea what you're talking about. <laughs> Balls. Oh, balls. <laughs> Nods. <laughs> Look at his face. Just... <sighs> okay, you seem to remember. <clears throat> Carla, we are ready. Please initiate the training sequence. VRPs are the most essential tool and weapon. They're basically like balls. Your task is to hit all these robots with VRPs. So give it a shot, or rather, a throw. <laughs> <laughs> I love the facial expressions. Oh! So if you want to do it fast, it's inaccurate, so you would have to... <clears throat> huh. Okay. Nice work. Well, just to be sure, let us repeat this exercise with an extended distance. Ugh. <laughs> Something uh, particular about VRPs, they are not affected by gravity. Thus, no matter how far you throw, VRPs will not fall to the ground. Nice. Yeah, that's really cool. Oh, so the, you don't even have to hold it down. It's just the more you focus on one area. Okay. <clears throat> Very good. Okay, next, let us enable the charge mode. Charge mode. You activated charge v VRPs by aiming for a longer time. Let us practice away. <clears throat> a. Hey, there it goes. My mouse is a little messed up, so I'm trying to hold it down, but it clicks anyway, so that's going to be a little bit aggravating. I'm hoping to get a new uh, mouse soon. Well, that was quick. I suppose I talked too much again. Anyway, enough. Wait, was he talking to me the whole time? I, I had a feeling it was going to be able to ricochet. Put you down on your feet. It's about it's about time we put you down on your feet. Carla, we are done here. You can, you can terminate the flotation sequence. 
What was that? Oh, I'm floating this whole time. I just realized that. Hey there, girl. Welcome to our cozy cargo hold. I was hoping. I was wishing. I was hoping I'd be able to use space. Can I use G? Oh no, that skips. All right, never mind. My name's Carla. Nice to meet you. Uh, you sure are a quiet one. Apparently, there is an issue with her speech speech synchronization. She still understands us, though. No way. Is there a way to fix it? I do not know yet. I will have to look into that. Anyway, I'm sure we'll be able to understand each other somehow. Nonverbal communication, you know. Just start learning sign language. Atta girl. Still kinda would like to know your name. Sir Sergey? Can you help us out in here? Right, her okay, so his name is Sergey. Right. Her name is Leia. Leia. Well ain't that sweet. I, I like that they gave her a name. I hate games that just keep making you choose your name. I, I I want you to write the character. I don't want to write the character myself. Sometimes it's nice to be able to like make your own character, but I've done so many of those games that I just I want them to talk to my character as I don't want to have to write my own character. <laughs> well then, Leia, ready to re uh, ready to get out? We gotta get you ready for what's coming. Ball throwing ain't that ball throwing in the like, you know. And I and uh, I can't even read. And I got just a thing prepared for you. Follow me. Alrighty then. Ooh, arrows. That's escape to access the paws. Oh, you get to see. Oh, that's nice. I love. God, I love that so far. No, 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 no. I don't know if I was supposed to talk to her, but that's fine. Reach the exit. All right, let's get started. Your task is to reach the door at at the other end of the room. And don't mind me. I'll just stick around and keep an eye on you. Well, I might give you some hints if you ask nicely, you know? Yeah, asking something I can do. Okay. Oh yeah, never mind the visor, I just need this to see what you're doing. Do not worry about it for now, we will explain it la uh, explain it later. Okay. Nice. Okay, so yellow things you can shoot through. That you can destroy. Oh. Nice. Okay, I'm starting to get it. All right. How do I get up there, though? Oh, so I can get up. Oh, okay. Ooh. Okay, let's try this. Okay, so leveling is very important. That's gonna be weird. Entering the next stage, more switches await. I like how they're not like going through each one. They're like allowing you to see. Okay, so you gotta hit that multiple times for it to work. See, I, they're allowing you to figure it out instead of wasting your time talking and talking. You sure are natural with the ball thing. <laughs> They are called VRPs, not balls. Oh, come on. Nobody calls them that anymore, you know? Unfortunately, yes. Nope. Oh. I'm stupid. Okay. Oh, I'm stupid. So you can't... You can't... Ch uh, charge. And shoot fast. Okay. Well, sorry, no, no, no. 
you can't ricochet these. You have to charge to ricochet. Give me a sec, I think my dog was barking. Never mind, I am perfectly good. Okay, I'm starting to get this. Huh, finally, this one's my favorite. Uh, here you can go wild on these robot mice. Oh, they're cute, they are mice. Moving target practice, have fun, girl. Nice. I wonder, does this shoot through enemies? It does not. Okay, cool. <clears throat> uh, I gotta go th up here first. Can't do that. Can I? Oh, I gotta do this. Oh, I gotta destroy that first. There we go. Okay, nice. <clears throat> Moving on. Hey, I found a head in mice. Mouse. Oh, this is a counter. So I have to kill the enemies. Okay. See, I didn't even notice that in the last one. <clears throat> this is a really well done tutorial. Just... If you, if you think you can figure it out, you, you can figure it out yourself. You, you don't have to wait for them to tell you. Which is so nice, because I can just blitz through this. It's also nice for speedrunners, too. Welcome to the Rats Fortress, standing un, uh, unpenetrated for centuries. Apparently, somebody had a fun time putting this together. Uh, doesn't seem unpenetrated to me. Cause I can still shoot through it. Yeah, that wasn't hard at all. Unpenetrated for centuries. Well, you have centuries of idiots. <clears throat> Slow down there, girl. Just short warning here, you'll meet your first real enemies. And by real, I mean those things will, in fact, attack you. Okay. Don't get me wrong, they're really easy, but still. If you don't get beat down, uh, if you do get beat down, your respawn point is right in this room. Alright, um, that means there's no real danger. Go ahead and kick some ass. Uh, just a moment. Let me enable the dash module before we get, before we start battle. Dash. So that should be my, uh, dodge thing, right? Dash is essential in battle since it helps you to quickly dodge enemy attacks at any time. Ready is. Now please enter to the right, uh, in order to process with the ass kicking. <clears throat> Too easy. Bit of advice, hit them with the charge balls to cancel their attacks. Okay. Good to know. Okay. I like spinning. Yes, that was awesome, girl. Sergey, you weren't kidding. She really got a knack for this. Yeah, that sure takes me back. Hmm? <clears throat> hey, champ, get your adrenaline down again for a second. We gotta add a bit more edge to your arsenal. A sharp one, that is. Ooh, sword. I see that got your attention. Sergey, you finished? Yes. Unlocking virtual proximity impact now. Melee. <laughs> Great, with those combat strikes called VPI. You can quickly tear through several targets in your path at once. Only them close um, only them close ones, of course. You got that? Sharp as a blade, now start be now start by clearing that path for us, will you? Absolutely. <coughs> Near lay inside the circle to perform a close combat. Alternative, just press. Oh, that's a shoot. Oh, okay. <clears throat> okay, cool, cool, cool. Wait there for a second. Yeah, I know. A second waited is an, is an, 
A second weight is an attack wasted. Still, you should know that your strikes have enough punch to interrupt some attacks. So you can just pummel your opponents without giving them a chance to strike back. Hmm. Sounds like a plan. Am I right? So go get them. So, hit them fast, hit them hard. <clears throat> it didn't even see it coming. Nice. I, I didn't even read what they were saying. And another victory for our fearless gladiator, Leah. Attack! Attack with everything I have! Attack! Attack! I like melee more. Uh -uh. Oh, I see my health at the top. I, I like playing a computer game now because I can just, like, point to stuff instead of saying those. Like, if you see here at the top left, I can just be like, do. And you just crossed the finish line. <laughs> Did I cross code? Congrats. <clears throat> Seriously, girl, that was quick. It's like you've never forgotten the basics at all. Oh my, you still look puzzled by all uh, about all this. I suppose it's, I suppose it is about time we explain all the circumstances. You bet it is. But let's take a short break before that, okay? I still need to report the, uh, to the captain. He wants to meet Leia, uh, Leia for the first time. Is it going to be Leia or Leia? I'm going to go with Leia. Good idea, but not best not keep Jet waiting for too long. His name is Jet. All right. Is there any collectibles? I kind of hope there's not because I don't want to stress over collectibles. <laughs> right. All right. Up to the bridge. Oh, yeah. Leia, just a heads up. The captain's kind of grumpy, but don't worry about it. That's just the way he is. <laughs> they really did give her character, even though she says nothing. Uh, Cap, I'm back with the report. I see. Go on. Is that a jetpack? <laughs> the initiation. Uh, the initiation? A total... Cinch? Cinch. Here's the avatar. Name's Leia. I... Hard to miss that, lass. Hope you didn't run into anything. It's everything with those horns there. Oh, I do have horns. <laughs> Looks like she just noticed too. <laughs> Wait, don't tell me you didn't notice the horns till now, Leia. <laughs> oh, I love her. <clears throat> anyway, make sure you clean up that mess you started down here in the cargo hold soon. Yes, cat. I hope Sergei's satisfied. Is he around? Yeah, just give me a sec to set up your headset. Hello there, Jet. My good man, it's about- it's been a long time. Indeed. You are still clinging to that jetpack. I, I was right, it is a jetpack! You know I never traveled to saw you without good old Bay. <laughs> anyway, I hope you two will be ready to travel on soon. Having a Dawn Avatar on board is just calling for trouble. Of course, we will make this as brief as possible. Gee, Cap, what kind of welcome is that supposed to be? Besides, ain't we talking to Jet, former VRP dueling champ? You keep telling us all about your combat moves from the old days. So, so here I thought maybe you'd want to give Leia a small combat lesson. Ooh, bring it on. You're telling me that we last us up for a battle? Yeah, oh, you bet she is. Right. We'll see, we'll see about that. Just talk to me later today. Sweet. Now then, you dismissed. You can show the last around the ship, but don't you stir up any trouble. All right, Captain. I like him. I like Jetpack Boy. Come on, Leia. It's time for fresh air. Hey, <laughs> I can't wait to breathe. <laughs> Welcome aboard the MS Solar. I immediately thought those were like Smash Bros. Um logos Leia for Smash Bros like confirmed what quite the ship huh oh she's so cute she's like <gasps> I love Leia you know the view here is nice but you gotta see what's beyond the bow we're currently steering towards Rumpus Square that's something to look at actually why not go to the bow and explain the situation to Leia there 
Seeing Rampa's square will make it easier for her to understand, correct? Hey, good thinking, Sergey. Follow me, Leia. I like how I can still hear the bird. <clears throat> there she is, the Avatar! <laughs> I am the Avatar, master of all four elements. And she's a... Spheromancer? Oh, I have classes? Neat. And she's a Spheromancer class. How awesome is that? And I'm like... What's that? <laughs> looks like you got... Uh, looks like you got your first fan, Leia. <laughs> she's like, yeah, damn right I do. Hey there, Carla. Good to see you. About all these strange boxes here. Yeah, I know. I'm supposed to clean that up. But right now, I have to take care of the Avatar, you know? I'll do it in a bit, okay? See you later. There she goes again. She said exactly the same thing yesterday. A Spheromancer! So awesome! The bow is this way. It's a bit of a walk, though. Just follow me. Carla, that were all those destructional boxes doing in that room anyway. I was just practicing how to use those things, you know? Probably should have done that somewhere else. Now, girl, have a look at this. Oh, wow. She's like, ugh. <laughs> okay, where to start? How about, welcome to Cross Worlds. Nani? <laughs> uh, one step at a time, Carla. Leia, do you remember the concept of an MMO? Yes. I'm gonna make it easier. Like, I, I, I know what an MMO is. <laughs> All right. Uh, now, Cross Worlds is like an MMO, just with one striking difference. It's real, you die here, you die in real life. <laughs> the world of this game is not- Oh, okay, <laughs> it is real. <laughs> All players are remotely connected to this world through special avatars. Oh! These avatars have a physical form and are tightly connected to all five senses of the player. The amount of porn-related things that they have probably done with this, I'm baffled. And you, Leia, are currently logged into this game as well, by me. <laughs> so, somebody's controlling me? Oh, me? No, I'm not a player, I just work here. In fact, you're the only avatar on this whole ship. That is correct, this cargo ship belongs to the maintenance staff of Crossworlds. The actual game takes place in the land you see over there, the playground. The reason you are here, Leia, is because you are not a regular player. You have lost your memory and we are trying to recover it. Oh. You see, you have been here you have been in this game before. Being logged into this game, there's a chance you might remember your past. <laughs> Yawning. <laughs> and that is what and that is why we will try to get you into the real playground soon. Yeah, in fact, you'll be going uh, to that glass palace of a city over there. Ooh. That's Rampus Square. It's where all the pl uh, all players start. All right, neat. So it's kind of like an Izakai. Well, I guess it's cleared up some things at least, right? No. All right, then I think it's I think this is a good time to split. So does that mean there's somebody out there with a VR headset controlling me right now and they don't have their memory? I'm just an avatar. So they're trying to reach the person controlling Leia, right? Or did I misunderstand that? I'm going to go talk to the captain and try to set up that combat lesson for you. Meanwhile, you can have a look around the ship if you like. The crew knows about you. I guess you already noticed that, right? You can meet me and the captain later. Until then, just make sure not to fall into the water, girl. By the way, Leia, I had a closer look at those speech synchronization issues. Unfortunately, I do not think I will be able to fix them soon. Oh. However, I found a little workaround. I might be able to hard code specific audio patterns into your speech module. That means you will be able to say certain words. That should be a that should help a bit, correct? They're gonna treat me like the dude from Jujutsu Kaisen and I just speak in like ramen um, bowl ingredients. I think that's what it was. Mustard leaf. <laughs> so let's try it out. New word. <laughs> New word unlocked. Hi. <laughs> Hi. Hi. 
Hi, 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 hi. <laughs> it works. That should help you start some conversations with the crew here. Why don't I just... <laughs> just wave. Hi! Oh, she's so cute. Hello there. You must be a uh, guest on the ship, right? Hi! <laughs> Why, don't be shy. We, we seamen may look rough, but we're easygoing folks. Really. You know, uh, you want to know what I'm doing here? I'm currently checking up on solar panels here. These are our primary energy source. As I'm reading this, I'm trying to figure out what voice I want to do. So they better work properly. Otherwise, our nice and shiny MS solar won't budge a centimeter. Trust me, being stuck in the ocean too long is not something you want to experience. Huh, I suppose he did not even notice you on Avatar. Well, the human appearance is pretty convincing. Except for the hair color. <laughs> Dude, I know, you, I know you're new around here, but really, you gotta be more relaxed. What, just because I was too quick about cleaning duty? It wasn't really that much. I, I feel that. Well, if you will, people will notice. Oh, hey, you're that Avatar girl, right? Excuse me, uno momento. A friend of mine is calling me. My apologies for that. I am back. Oh, hey, you're that Avatar girl, right? Hi! <laughs> She's so fucking cute. <laughs> I was just giving our newbie here a lesson. Hey, I've been working here for six months. You sure? Before you know it, you'll you'll be cleaning the whole deck from uh, front to back every day. Hmm. So just little bits of conversation every here and the, uh, every now and then, here and there. I like it. Oh, okay. So I can't. I can't just go around the whole map like this. I have like, I have like three dodges that I can do, but I have to wait for it to kind of reload. Otherwise, I'm just dancing. Okay. Kind of want to see if I can go up there. I just can't do it in succession, because I don't have to wait that long. Ah, oh, looks, look who's here. You must be that avatar, right? Well then, welcome to the MS Solar. If you lean over the railing a bit, you might even see the name of the ship. MS Solar. Oi, make sure you don't fall into the sea. I'm pretty sure Avatar is about to swimming. Ooh, robot. Hi! She's so happy that she can just say hi. That's so cute. Hey, can't you see... <laughs> hey, can't you see I'm busy here? Wait, who are you? Oh, right, I remember now. You're that pseudo-robot thing. <laughs> oh, no offense. You see, I just uh, recently had this discussion with a colleague. It was about avatars being the same as robots, and I have to insist they are not. Avatars are just some fragile, temporary collection of instant matter. Everybody knows real robots are made of metal, like these beauties here. So I just can't share the excitement of my colleagues about your presence. You're just an avatar, no true robot, see? Thanks. Anyway, I have to take care of my babies here, so if you'll excuse me. What a prick. But at least he actually gave me some insight on, uh, I am not a robot. I am... The avatars are something completely different, so it was a dick way of telling me that, but at least I have information for that. Hi! Do you not speak either? Oh, that's... I wonder if he's a legitimate mute. That's cute. Oh, sorry, I'm busy checking the containers here. <laughs> I thought he was mute too, I thought I was just gonna keep going. <laughs> Hi! Oh, Avatar incoming, I must say, I'm surprised. I expected the embodiment of some gamer kitty's wildest dreams, lots of beefcake and such. Yet, here we are, uh, yet here we have such a cute girl. Oh. <laughs> Too bad that doesn't really say anything about the player's actual appearance. Just like in old days of MMO, some things never change. 
Oh my, that's some extremely colorful hair you have there. I heard that Avatar designs tend to be flamboyant, but really? And those horns too. <laughs> she doesn't like her horns now. You're not happy about them either, huh? Now I have to wonder who put those on you. <laughs> oh, he going. Wait, so did Sergey make her? I thought they were just like. Oh no, he put the horns on her. Whatever. Oh, Miss Avatar is back. Hi. <laughs> Whoa, she talked to me. <laughs> She's like, so. <laughs> Hi. Gee, calm down there, fella. Anyway, Carla just passed by us again. She told us, um, she told us that you could take care of all the these boxes here. <laughs> that bitch. I mean, really, can you believe that woman? Now she's loading off her work on our guests. Well, she has a point. It's easy to destroy these boxes with your avatar weapons, right? Uh huh. Awesome. Please, I want to see that. Well, no pressure, you know? You are our guest after all, but you help us out a lot. So, will you destroy the box for us? Too easy. Yes. <laughs> Show us the balls! <laughs> bump, bump. Well, it certainly works. Oh, these have metal on them. Oh, okay, so I gotta be a little strategic with it. Hey. <laughs> Hold up. I got it. Ah, I got it. Nice. Hell yeah. I am low key impressed with myself. Nice. Now I just gotta destroy this in. Boom. Oh, oh, I missed one. I'm so stupid. Over here. Nope, nope. Jump. Boom, boom. Ah, no! Speedrunning this must be uh, entertaining. There we go. All clear. Truly amazing. I'm really surprised how quickly those balls were flying. God, he really likes the balls. What are you even talking about? I didn't see any balls. Only those boxes disappearing for... Oh, because they need the glasses for them. Yeah, you need to wear uh, these AR goggles to see them. The balls and, uh, and their impact are all, like, virtual and stuff. I see. So that's why you've been wearing those goofy glasses all day. Wait, hold on. So, if the balls can mess with inanimate objects, but you but they're practically invisible to the eye unless you're wearing the AR goggles cuz it's all virtual. It's virtual, but it can actually damage things. Are the boxes virtual? If that's the case, how can they see the boxes? I'm a little confused. Goofy, you know nothing about style, lady. Yeah, whatever. Anyway, thanks for all. Uh, anyway, thanks a lot for the help. <laughs> yes, thank you so much, Miss Avatar. Yep, not a problem. Call me Cora. <laughs> no, she's lame. Call me Aang. <laughs> oh God, please don't give me options. Okay. I know that there's probably like tons of places I can go and people I can talk to, but I don't. I don't know where I'm supposed to go. Hi! Are you looking for the captain? I think he's currently somewhere in the cabins. Indeed, even a captain needs a break once in a while. Alright, cabins. Gotcha. Uh, let's check the second floor. Are you, you good? Oh, hi! Hi! Whoa, you spoke! Is your voice finally back? Hi. Hi. <laughs> Wait, that 
That ain't right. Her speech synchronization is still malfunctioning. I just hard-coded the word hi into her speech module. That is all she can say for now. I am currently working on adding more words. I see. It's a start, I suppose. Anyway, the captain and I here have been planning out your combat training, girl. We're almost set and good to go, right? Oi, this is gonna be interesting. Well, I'm off to I'm off to my cabin for some final preparations. I'll be done in no time, so just stick with the captain, okay? See you later. Yay, super awesome badass captain with a super awesome accent. Oi, I'll be back on the bridge. You can, I'm, I'm gonna make him serious no matter what he's saying. You can talk to me when you're ready for the list. Make sure you're prepared. I'll be expecting your full attention. You two over there. Make sure you clean up the galley after you've done cooking. Understood? Is that what they're doing? They look like they're exercising. Aye, aye, Captain! It's not like we forgot since the last time you told us. Yeah, wasn't that yesterday? I wonder why they're grayed out. Like, is it just because they're side characters? Interesting. Um, I totally forgot where he told me to go. I'm gonna go to the bridge. I'm just gonna go ahead and talk to him. There you are. It's about dawn time for your combat lesson. You ready? Yep. Good. Let's go to the balcony. Combat lesson. Bring it the fuck out. Good. Here we are. Carla! Are you ready up there? Yes, Cap. Don't forget the goggles. Oi. Sick. Sick as fuck. Haven't worn these for some time. Alright then. Time to start. I was told he learned the basics down in the cargo hold. Still. First I want you to show me your grip on aiming and throwing. Carla, prepare the target bot. Time to say hello to an old friend. I'm blanking out on trying to read. <laughs> Listen carefully. I want you to hit that robot from the distance ten times. From this distance. Do it quickly. Got that? Easy. Oi. Just as I expected. You notice how half of them balls missed the target? You still need to understand how to aim properly. I'll show you how it's done. Watch closely. <laughs> See them dotted lines? That's the throwing range. So, I, I, I assume I have to hold down the first one and then the rest of mine. They'll be flying randomly between these two lines. That's a pretty darn sloppy throw. We won't have that. Yeah, blah, 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 now fact. I, I'm skipping through it now. Precision won't. Yep. But clearly this time, you want to be qu uh, precise quicker. Then you better keep the aim and stop the darn throwing. Quick, wasn't it? Once you get your lines connected, you can throw with high precision. You know, I was about to do that, but I didn't think you were gonna, like, take the time to demonstrate everything for me. Don't rush with the throwing. First, wait for a split second in precision, then... Okay, yep. Nah... Your choice. Just keep in mind that good aim is essential for combat. Carla, we need that turret now. We need that turret now! Time to turn on an old Betty. Flying. Next, we'll be practicing the dash. The turret will now start shooting at you. I want you to do two things. First, keep your, keep your aim on the turret, but don't throw anything. Second, dodge the turret bullets without losing your aim. All right. That's a faster. I'll try again. Oh my god. I'm sorry. Okay, cool. Sorry. I was I was freaking out because my uh my thing doesn't want to Oh, 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 shit. <laughs> the heck was that? Don't you know how to darn guard, lass? Actually, Jet, as a matter of fact, she does not. 
I forgot to activate her guard module. Sergey, are you serious? You can't send the last into battle without a proper shield. <laughs> you can't send the last into, bot into battle without a proper shield. Yes, I will fix that right now. Sweet. Thanks, jackass. You forgot to give me a guard. Good, so now you have a shield. Need an instruction on how it works? Do I have to throw the shield up? C or without moving to... Oh, okay. Only block the front, always in the direction. Finally, you can even aim during guard while it's... Yes. Very good. That's all the basics. I can teach you for now. Now to round everything up, let's have a proper battle against a turret where you can use everything you've learned. Though, there will be a little surprise waiting for you. Else, I'll let you take a short breather. Talk to me when you're ready. I'm, I'm ready. Just fucking... Yes. Oh, I hit the wrong one. Oh. Oh, so it overheats. Okay. Aha. Captain, I'm sorry to interrupt, but we need you on the bridge right now. Oh, come on. I was about to beat this thing's ass. What's the matter? Something is approaching us in quickly. Bloody dawn timing. Sorry, Les, but we have to stop here. Duty calls. Carla, uh, you clean up the balcony first and come to the bridge afterwards. Oh, no, no, no. He was saying that. I'm. She popped up and I thought she was saying that. She's Carla. Understood. His accent just dropped immediately. <laughs> Girl, I have no idea what's going on here, but it better be for you to go inside, too. It's still on the radar, approaching approaching us at high velocity. No transmission, no dawn ship to see. What's going on here? Captain, I think I caught it on the satellite. You gotta see this. <laughs> okay. Okay. Is that Goku? <laughs> <laughs> oh, he looks ridiculous. What a peculiar location we have here. It's a Dawn cargo ship, you dobber. <laughs> you dobber. You look like someone who jumped right out of Crossworlds. This ship is not part of the bloody playground, so don't be a nuisance and get lost. We are aware of the nature of this place. Yet we perceive the presence of another misplaced individual. That's none of your bloody business. Get off this ship and back to the game you came from. Foolish mortal, do you truly believe we will abide by your command? Did you just call me a mortal? <laughs> you nutcase. <coughs> Bitch, I can fly too. <laughs> you better leave right now or I'll be glad to tighten your grip on reality. You bore us. We choose to no longer converse with the likes of you. Oh, what the fuck? Besides, our search has already been concluded. Hi. You. You do not belong here. You do not need, but well, you need to be removed. Ah? Uh? <laughs> Wait, you seem all too familiar. Why? It can't be. Indeed, it might be mere coincidence. Oh, but we most definitely have a way to be certain. Are we fine? What a convenient stage we have here. Now, it is time to face your trial. Oh shit! I'm fighting a crab. <laughs> I'm fighting a damn crab. Let us see if you are the genuine article. 
A display of your talent shall suffice as proof. Alright. Leia? Do you hear me? I'm just as confused about this whole situation as you are. It is certainly a mess, but we will we will get you out of this. For now, take on this challenge and keep him busy. I know this enemy looks intimidating, but do not lose hope. I am confident you will be able to handle this. Because I can see its battle stats. They match your level. Mm. Right, let's do this. Holy <laughs> shit! Okay. Mm, that that was loud. Okay. Dodge everything, wait for the opening. Okay. Mm, that's so loud. Hopefully this is good. Come on. Sweet. Alright. I was messing up so badly early. Hey! There's a leveling system. Okay, I didn't know that. Alrighty then. Nice, nice. Very nice. Yeah! <laughs> I love it. This is this spinning motion. One cannot find it twice in this world. Truly, there is no doubt about it. When was the last time we have laid eyes upon you? You within your inco incomplete vessel. Yes, you have a utmost interest. You will come with us. Uh, no. Oh, dude, did you? Oh, he just got shot by a freaking RPG. I love it. Greetings from your solar fist. You boil of instant matter. What's this? You divine powers can't handle the proper explosion. <laughs> Why you? This is preposterous. I gotta get a uh, cover on this mic. I have one, but I gotta attach it. And it's just a weird angle. Ugh. I need to get like a sock. <laughs> okay, Les. You need to get off this ship right now. Carla, get her back. Get her back to the teleporter as fast as possible. And tell me once she's off the ship. I'll make sure no trace of cross worlds is left on my ship. Got a cat. I like this guy. Like, he doesn't... He takes charge and he'll shoot him with a freaking rocket launcher if he has to. We gotta go. We gotta get off the ship. Oh, holograms. Well, well, our endeavor has not been concluded. You will not escape our will. You already caught up? Leia, those are high-level opponents. Do not fight them. Run to the teleporter. I kind of want to fight them. <laughs> okay, don't do that. Oh, that was hilarious. I wanted to, I just wanted to see. Oh my god. Ah, ah, oh shit. 
Okay. Where do I gotta go? Where do I go? Oh! I trapped myself, that's why. I like how it's not punishing me so much for this. Uh oh. Damn, how are we supposed to- How are we gonna pass this one? Wait, I got an idea. You could've just done that this whole time? Are you serious? Here we are again. Time for you to leave this party. I don't want to leave. Come on, sweetie. This isn't the time for tearful goodbyes. You gotta go now. Besides, there are those guys. Goodbye, Leia. Enjoy Crossworlds. Did my entire ship just die? <laughs> you don't pile of instant matter. <laughs> Stop putting your trash all over the ship. This ain't gonna go nowhere. It's a double negative, my dude. <laughs> Jet, we did it. But he almost got us. There are probably some enemies left down in the cargo hold. Putting even more trash in my cargo hold. Okay, that's it. Playtime is over. Crew, activate the neutralizer. You're meddling with matters that are not of your concern. This is my ship. Dobbers like you messing with my ship are on the bloody top of my list of concerns. I said it before, I'll say it again. This cargo ship is not of the bloody playground. Oh, okay, so it was like an EMP thing. <laughs> I thought he just blew up the whole ship. I was like, damn, what a boss. What the bloody hell was that all about? <laughs> damn. Get fucked. He kicked ass. I like him. I'm gonna miss him. Initializing Avatar. We did it, Leia. I still can't believe that uh, what just happened on the Anna Solar. Anyway, we are now in the excuse me in the official playground. This area is packed with all kinds of security measures. Ugh. Yawning now. More interference from that blue individual is highly unlikely here. For now, let's just proceed. This is Rompus uh, Rompus Square, or more precisely, Newcomer's Bridge. This is the official introduction to Crossworlds. Nice! Maybe uh, we can get all the bits of the MMO that's uh, actually fun. Yo! This is, like, every single MMO ever, you always play as a character that's like, Oh, you're like, the one and only true hero, but every single character has that introduction to them, so it doesn't feel special at all. This, it is saying it is an MMO, but you actually are the one-of-a-kind different person. And that's why I like single-player games more. This is the official introduction to Crossworlds. I placed you right in front of the last part. It is important that we do this part uh, the official way to avoid suspicion. So I have to pretend that I'm a player. Ah oh, yes, speaking of suspicion. Listen, Leia. It is absolutely essential that you pass as a regular player. We must avoid being reported at any cost. This. Uh, hi. Uh, yes. Don't- <laughs> She's like, I can't even speak. Do not worry too much about your speech synchronization issues. I, I like how she can finally say hi, so now she can just use it in sarcastic ways. You are, in fact, not the first player with these problems. <sighs> Excuse me. Just say you don't have a mic. <laughs> well, you can't say it. Anyway, just be careful, okay? They're probably going to be asking, like, hey, can you do a text-to-speech? 
Hi. <laughs> Most of these players here should be newcomers just like you. Veterans usually skip this part, obviously. This is seriously high up. Yeah, good thing they added those laser railings. Yes, gotta love lasers. Movement blocking lasers. The best type of laser there is. Okay, good to know. These block movement. I'll talk to this person. Congratulations on reaching the third stage of Newcomer's Bridge. Thanks. You have just arrived at the final waiting area. You can take a break here and enjoy the view. Once you are ready, uh, once you are ready, proceed to the teleporter at the other end of this area to enter the final stage. Nice. Come on, there's no need to be afraid. You know I can't deal with heights. It's all just a game. There's no danger, you know. I know it just feels so real. Just give me some time, okay? All right. And then all that going on right there. And then random person. I want to see if I can... Oh, okay, I talked to this person. Hi! Oh, hey, what's up? What's the matter? First a greeting and now silence? You're a strange one. Oh, she seems so sad. S sorry, that came across the wrong way. You must be here for the view. It's gorgeous, right? Across the world expands over the whole land you, s uh, you see over there. People call it the croissant. <laughs> Is this seriously called a croissant? Uh, cross? Yeah, no, that's because the island is shaped like one. Well, they actually do call it the croissant. Oh, I thought I misspoke. Or misread, sorry. God, that's so stupid. Oh, God, I can't wait to go to the croissant. Uh, I'm probably going to go ahead and end it here. I think this is a good little beginning portion. And uh, we'll start with that next area soon i feel like if i walk over there it's immediately gonna start yes nice and i like how i can just save anywhere so that's that's helpful cool well that was actually really fun i very much like this game i do love the main character leia and i the the comments for all that stuff was correct they actually know how to write a uh, a character who can barely speak and that is so fascinating to me i i love how they didn't just make her permanently not be able to speak and just say it's like oh her uh her voice is just gone or whatever but no they they just straight up um say hey we're trying to fix it and you see it fixing it's nice it's different it's it's like it's literally i don't like mmos at all so this game is it feels like it's trying to give me the experience of an MMO, but without all the annoying stuff. Like, I don't like the 15 different currencies, the random paywalls, the, like, too much information in your face at once, the thousands of, like, players ranking from level 1 to, like, max level, like, god-like gear. So all the stuff's kind of ruined for you because you're like, oh, wow, that guy, that's, that's what my class is going to look like if I continue to play this game. It kind of spoiled it for me, so that sucks. And I don't know. I just I don't like MMOs. I don't. Last one I tried playing was Final Fantasy XIV, and I did like that one, but um, it just I kind of stuck with it. But this I like. I really like it, and uh, I'm very excited to continue playing this. Thank you guys so much for watching. If you really like this, make sure you leave a like, share. Um, I'm hoping that I can hit like a lot of people who are fans of this game because this has a kind of a small back following and I don't play indie games all that much and I'm starting to really like them. I'm I'm really thinking about making this entire channel just about indie games because every single one, like I always wanted to play them but I never got around to it. And so far the indie games that I've been playing more lately, I love them. I absolutely love them. And yes, I know Yakuza is in an indie game, but it's fun and I'm playing it, so shut up. <laughs> but um, again, thank you guys so much for watching and um, yeah. Good. Looking forward to this as a new series. So, cool deal. Thank you again. And until next time, I'll see you on Sonata. I gotta get better at my outros.